Hey guys! So, turns out that my next LP is gonna be a bit, well, is a little bit later than I expected, aka a whole day later. Anyway, as you can see, this is Summon Knight Swordcraft Story. I love this game. Ah, it's a great RPG, action RPG. Alright, so, male or female? Male. May. Uh, cup. Make up with who? Are you listening to me? Wake up! Oh, uh, it's just mom. I've tried to get you out of bed seven times this morning. Are you going for a new record? The opening ceremony is today. Remember, now get down here! That's today? Uh oh. I have to get ready in a couple of hours. You mean in a couple of seconds? What's that? Ah! Mom, what's going on? Are you okay, Mom? Entrance ticket. I can't get into the central tower without it. Alright. Mom, what happened? Hello? What are you talking about? Huh? Wasn't you that screamed? Of course it was. I just wanted to make sure you were awake. Don't do that. I thought you were hurt, or worse. Wah! That's an interesting way to come downstairs, isn't it? I think my note is broken. I think my note is broken. That looked like it hurt. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. Just a little embarrassed, that's all. How could you forget where the stairs are in your own house? Are you trying to make me f worry about you? Because it's working. Of course I didn't forget. I'm fine. I'm not so sure. Do you know where you are? What's your name? You're kidding, right? No, I'm not kidding. I'm making sure you're alright. Now tell me your name. Okay, okay. I'll tell you. Clearu. <coughs> My name is Clearu. Are you happy now? Next question. What's your job? I work for a craft knight, of course. What do you do for this craft knight? I'm his apprentice. And what does this craft knight do? He forges different type of metal. He's teaching me to forge weapons. Satisfied yet? No, not yet. What's my name? That's easy. Amiris. Uh, Amiris. What? That's not my name? Stop fooling around. I'm just kidding. You're fine. Of course I am. I thought the house was about to collapse. Slow to the uptake much? If you're playing as a female, she actually gets that. The, that apparently um, Amorous thinks her own kid is fat. <laughs> yeah, there have been a lot of those lately. I wonder why. What's happening today? Of course I do. Opening ceremony. Basically, the ceremony is to a tournament to become a craft lord. A craft lord is basically the most powerful craft knight. Well, one of the five most powerful craft knights. Uh... Amaris gave us <coughs> the charm that our father had. Uh, Central Tower. I'm starting to get nervous. What are you doing? Why are you just standing there? You're going to be late. Oh, it's you, Master. Good morning. I'm cutting it a little close, aren't you? I'll hurry up. Your father was slower than a turtle going uphill. Why are you listening to me talk? You're right. Hey, I'm heading back to the guild. Find me after the opening ceremony. Yeah, I'm trying to... I'm a bit frustrated that a previous recording didn't work. So, entrance ticket, please. You're clear, yes? The opening ceremony is taking place in this hall. Enter, please. There are a lot of people here. Hey, you. Who's your guardian beast? I haven't got one yet. Guardian beasts are essentially your party members. They cast magic... And that sort of thing. Alright. Three cra craft lords. Welcome, apprentices. Welcome, children of the craft knights who defend the city of swords. Today begins the tournament in which the skills you have learned will be tested. It was three years ago that we lost, lost Shintetsu, our strongest and most respected craft lord. Dad. It's been three years since the last time I saw him. Got to snap out of it and pay attention. And Shintetsu's loss was followed by the disappearance of Tyram, the craft lord of crystal. 
You need to find a replacement for these men to join the other craft lords of Wystern, as the guardians and protectors of Parista, the spirit that dwells within the Holy Sword. A position has been prepared for one of the apprentices in this chamber, and we will determine which of you standing before us is worthy of claiming this position. The majority of you lack the skill to be a w the apprentice, let alone a craft lord. But all of you possess the gift of youth, and a few of you the potential that comes with it. We must harness that potential to protect Weister. We must do whatever is needed to fortify the City of Swords. I should think a craft lord would know better to ha than to have such a flawed opinion. How does he explain all the adults in this city who cannot craft a decent weapon? Who's that? I don't know if he's talented, but he sure doesn't lack confidence. Next craft lord should be strong and beautiful, just like me. That girl is almost as full of herself as that boy. Look at all the these warrior wards. I'm guaranteed to win this tournament. How did that kid get into the tournament? He must be stronger than he looks. Enough. I can't be nervous. I have to keep my promise and win this tournament. <coughs> to test your skills and see which of you is worthy of becoming craft lord, you are allowed oh, to fight only with weapons that you have created yourself. Battle is won when your opponent yields to you or when their weapon breaks. That sounds easy enough. I know I can craft a weapon strong enough to see me through. So yes, there are two types of boss battles. Tournament battles and another kind we'll get into a bit later. I'll prove to everyone in Weistern that I'm worthy of becoming the next craft board. We will allow your masters to aid you in the forging of your weapons. We will also allow you to receive assistance during your battles, but only one partner is allowed to accompany you into combat. A partner? I bet he's referring to a guardian beast. I wonder how many of these people have one. All of you are hereby granted passage into the dungeon of the central tower. There, you can collect materials with which to craft your weapons. The person who possesses the keys to the dungeon will bring one of each to you later on. The dungeon of the central tower leads to the shrine of Parista. I've heard stories uh, of summoned creatures that were summoned to protect Parista and no longer listen to their masters. There are many dangers in this dungeon placed there to ensure the, the safety of the great Parista. These dangers will not be lessened or removed for you. You, have to, you will have to confront them and overcome them on your own. If you cannot defend yourself, you are not worthy of being in this tournament. Gulp. As for who you will fight in each round of the tournament, your opponent will be announced by the central tower before, your, before the start of your battle. So he won't know who we're fighting until the last minute? That seems like a strange way to arrange the tournament. You must always remember the Craft Knight's Code. A sword is not strength, a sword is not skill, a sword is not fellowship. Let the guide, let the code guide your efforts. They will be rewarded. Friendships will be forged in the heat of battle. When your skill is sharpest and your weapon is deadliest, you will be your own master. I sincerely hope that one of you will become our equal and join us as a craft lord. That is all. <coughs> the ceremony is complete. Alright, so now we need to head back to the Silver Guild. Okay, so... Let's go ahead and... <coughs> ah, there you are. And you're late again. Apology accepted. You have confidence. Of course I do. I'm the son of Shintetsu, the Craft Lord of Iron. I'm guaranteed to win the tournament and make you proud. I admire your confidence. I'm gonna be blunt, you don't have the skill or brains to win the tournament, you don't even have the skill to win your first battle. Thank you for your brutal honesty, Master, I think. But you don't have to worry because I'm gonna tell you how to take this tournament. Never crafted a weapon. You think you'd be in the tournament if you couldn't craft your own weapon? Also, you should remember that I've got a, other apprentices in the tournament too, and I'm not going to play favorites with any of you. All right, master. All right then. Follow me to my room. I've got spe something special for you. Master, is that a summoner? He'll summon my guardian beast. Okay. Uh, I want to be more like my dad. Most important to a craft knight. Consideration for living things. More of a fighter than a tree hugger. What does love mean to you? 
caring deeply. Oh god, I hope I don't get a particular one. Alright, so the Summonite summons a Guardian Beast. And, of course I get the one I didn't want. Oh well. It's kind of funny, because apparently she, she likes you no matter which gender you have. So, the same Guardian Beast as your father, you've seen her before? She's, I don't know. She's, I don't know. I don't know. Why is she blushing? Uh, let's go upstairs. Wait, what? Oh, my God. This is going to be hilarious. Here you are. This is my workshop. Well, this is my workshop. Hope you like it. You're going to be working your day and night. Are you kidding? <coughs> yes, master. Uh, this is where our new life begins, Master Clearer. It does? I mean, it does. When we go outside. I'd love to see the ocean. That's a good idea. After everything that's happened today, I need a break. This master. Master. I haven't have been to the harbor for so long. It's beautiful. Look at the ship. Let's go aboard. Won't we get into trouble for asking for doing that without asking? Of course not. So nice of you. I'm so tired I can barely enjoy it. What's wrong? Nothing. I'm just very glad to have met you, Mr. I'm glad to meet you, too. I want to be a great craft lord just like Dad. Will you help me? Yes, I will. By the way, yes? I'm a creature in constant need of kindness. <laughs> All right. Would you be kind be? Uh, sure. What? <laughs> Fiance, no. <I'm laughs> oh, wow. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. This is so... Hilarious. This is hilarious. Uh, I was about to go see you. Uh, do we get our labyrinth key? Now you are underground. Show this key to the garden, the first floor of the t central tower, and you can enter the labyrinth. Labyrinth is a treasure mine for cr half nights. If you're going to be a strong... Alright, so... More the... Then... Um, randomly fu more than treasure items you're gonna be um using your monster drops to make your materials Uh, iron ore is only 10 bone. One bone is basically one gold. Or copper in World of Warcraft. Normally, I would end off the video here, but we are barely into it. So, let's head off over to the item shop. <coughs> Welcome to my shop. Do you have any iron ore here? I'm sorry, we just sold out. Really? She bought all we had. Uh, maybe we should ask the girl nicely. What should I do? Forget it. I can't do that. I'll see what she says. Pardon me. Sell us some the sugar. <laughs> Have I met you before? Participating in the tournament too? Surprise! Someone has faced at us. You had the guts to enter the tournament. What's that supposed to mean? I'm not going to sell you any. I don't have time to mess with you. Right. What should I do? Let's just talk. Tell old Braun about it. Yeah. Braun will know what to do. Uh, over here. You're back. Did you get the materials? Actually. What? They were completely sold out to a mean girl. That's correct. She said, I can't believe that someone is spaced out as you could enter the tournament. Something like that. I see. That's gotta be Santa Reed. She's one of my apprentices. And she's competing. She's a contestant just like you. I told her about the sales as well. How come... What did you expect? You weren't the only trainee here. I gotta be fair, you know. You're right. Tenerite descends to be tough on others, so I can only imagine that she picked on you, too. But don't you think that she could have at least sold us one of her wars? What she did was correct. Your rivals. The battle's begun in and out of the arena. There's no use worrying about that. You have to find your own materials. You told us that it's too dangerous to go there without weapons. Can we at least borrow a shut your trap? You're never gonna borrow 
<clears throat> uh, you already have the hammer. Oh boy. The hammer is horrible. <laughs> it's like 10 damage to a level 1 slime. But it. Unfortunately, it doesn't count as preliminary damage or whatever you call it. You'd call it like damaging before. Okay, so I guess I'll save. <laughs> My stuff. Oh. I'll save state. I have the key all right. Why don't we have any weapons? It's too dangerous. I have a weapon. Where? This hammer. That's a smithy hammer, isn't it? Did that work? We've got cuts. All right. If something happens, we'll tell your folks how brave you were. This is a teleporter. You'll use them to get between the floors. That's sanary. I won't give you any of my iron ore. Never told you to give it to me, and my name's Clearu. Okay, so Clearu, you're going to the labyrinth with just a hammer? Whose fault do you think this is? I couldn't make my weapon because I didn't have any iron. You're trying to tell me this is my fault? Are you crazy? Crazy like a fox. <laughs> if you're that determined to get materials, I'll help you. Okay, so you have to embarrass yourself. What kind of question is that? Oh, uh, you can get the wrong you can get material but not the kind you need bandages are the basic healing weapon oh excuse me it's actually you can press B to cast spells use items or guard if you tap B at just the right time you can and um guard all the damage all right, so Clearu and the, you and your summon beast have separate experience. Your exp experience increases your stats and your her health. Summon be he sticks levels increase. He's well give you access to new spells and oh yeah, in battle you can double tap and when you who attack from a double from a dash you generally can get an extra point of damage or 10 if you have got a good weapon level up okay clearer levels up and you can and you increase attack damage defense how okay each skill increases health but Defense increases it the most. Attack increases it the medium. Agility increases it at the least. I'm going with agility, though, because agility he improves your speed in battle. In other news, I managed to beat Mike Tyson, and I want to be the guy. There was much rejoicing. Hooray. <clears throat> uh, the combat is a lot better when you get actual weapons. Come on. Button mashing. Okay, 41 experience. Your bonus, I think, is if you... Who, um... Take less damage. Uh, Sanary? She might pick on you again. She seems different, though. A little more gentle. Who's there? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you. Don't mind. The place isn't mine. I can't tell you to leave. Really? Thanks. Uh, it's like an undersea observatory. My sister took me to this place a few years ago. I always wanted to come back here again. I always wanted to make it here without my sister's help. That's why this place is special to me. Every time I come here, I can feel that I'm getting closer and closer to her. You love your sister, don't you? I do. I've chatted long enough. I should get going. See ya. She doesn't sound that bad. Maybe she is. No cheating, Mr. <laughs> Clear. Oh, boy. <coughs> yeah, this is gonna be great. That was great. <coughs> Alright. 20 EXP. No bonus. 
iron ore. This is the material we were looking for. Uh, as I said earlier, monster drops are going to be your primary source uh, of ores. Each ore is represent represents a different element. There's wind, fire, earth, and water. And then there's one other I can't remember. It's not an elemental one. It's used to make the particularly good ones. And if you push against the side of the battle screen, you run away. Even though I really should have just went ahead and bandaged myself. You can make any item into materials, including weapons. And armor. <coughs> so if you need just a couple of wind ore, go ahead and buy uh, boots from the shop. Uh, I'm going to grind just a little bit. I'll be right back. Okay, I just wanted to get that last level up over with. Okay, so... Uh, oh, and it's jumping that helps you deal extra damage. Not sure why I thought it was running. Alright. Bottomless cup. Here we go. I actually got a monster drop. Okay. Monster drop. Done. I did it. it always, when I played Bomberman Hero when I was younger, it always sounded like monster drop or bomber drop or something. Okay, so. Crafting. You go up to your workshop, interact with the forge. First you want to create materials with items. Iron ore gives um, fire, wind, and water material. Bottomless cups give two water material. They're not that great, but hey, that's what you've got to work with. Alright, so your first weapon will be a novice sword. And your novice knife, excuse me. Now, it's finished. You did it, Master Clearu. Hey, so you completed your your first piece. <clears throat> Master. Let me take a look. How is it, Master Braun? Not bad. Keep up the good work. I guess Sugar did almost all the work, though. No, not at all. You watched out for me, making everything easier for me to work with. If you've got time to care for others, pay more attention to your work. Yes, sir. I'll do my best. I should have known it was clear running around making all the ruckus here. It took you all this time to make your first weapon? Well, excuse me, princess. There's nothing wrong, but you're such a slowpoke. You think you can win that with that kind of pace? Cut it out, you two. Yes, master. I guess that was unladylike of me. Clear was a bad influence. Me! Hey, you two. And I say stop. STOP! Yes, sir. Alright, so. We learn that we are allowed to battle the first boss. Chavs. Oh, boy. Chavs. He's slightly annoying. Equip your... Good luck. Do your best. He's not that strong of an opponent, but with the weapon you have now, it'll be tough. Yes, I don't think we're ready for the battle yet. Alright, so. And we... You, you can make a novice of weapon of any new type besides sword. Uh, I randomly pointed and I got spear. When you're ready, head to the arena on the first floor of Central Tower. I'm counting on you. All right, so with that, I'm gonna leave the video off. So. Next time on Let's Play Summon Knight Swordcraft Story, we're going to take on Chavs, the, the first boss. See you then.